everybody, it's Jeremy. Welcome back to Tactics Ogre Reborn. This is episode 26. What are we doing? We have taken Kurit and I keep, but we have to take Brigantis Castle. Let's save and go through our normal spiel. Uh, we will check the Warren report. My god. So many new things. Denim attacks the Galgastani garrison at Britain I Keep to aid victims of the war. Proceeding inside the keep, Denim is met by High Commander Zabos. As the prisoner, a prisoner of war revealed information about the whereabouts of High Commander Zabos, who had led the Galgastani army to defeat at Karitnai Keep, the prisoner also told of his horrible intention. Denim tried unsuccessfully to dissuade Kashua from returning to Goliath. Kashua revealed a startling secret about their missing father, Abuna Prancet. Uh, i.e. they are not the Abuna's children. The hero of Goliath returns! Kurit and I Keep has been wrested from the hands of High Commander Zabos. The Keep was liberated by Shadowhawks under the commander of former Wallister resistance soldier Denim Pavel, also known as the Hero of Goliath. All are curious at what Pavel's next move may be. Brigantis Cap's castle has been captured by remnants of the Galgastani army. High Commander Zabos leads the survivors and is urging other Galgastani soldiers to regroup but few have answered the call. It is thought the Wallister resistance will move to recapture the castle quickly. Blood Kurt and I keep. A Galgastani who served her clan in battle, Gildora was a reactionary historian who won favor with Galgastani hardliners for her publication, Memories of War, in which she detailed the illegal arrest and incarceration of the Galgastani by the Wallister. It was during her time at Kritnai Guild of Magi that Gildora blossomed into a full-fledged believer in Galgastani supremacy. The Wallister, in particular, she deemed an inferior race and deserving of eradication, though in truth she held a low opinion of the majority of people. Thus, she saw it to be her burden as an intellectual to speak the truth at all times and the burden of capable leaders to guide the masses. She joined the Galgastani forces when hostilities resumed and took great pleasure in the fact that her magic was a clear, and clear threat and impediment to the Wallister. She participated in the retaking of Kurt and I Keep and was given command of its defense. She was slain during an attack by Denim Pavel. Man of Deeds. Yes, Man of Deeds. All right, what do we got here? Oh, there's a familiar face. Really matter matter what we have here because we have like no money. Hey, it looks like none of the stuff is really new stuff. All their stuff. None of it's really. Um, unit list. You should have a different longbow. You should have a plus one. Like, there is no reason for you to not have a plus one longbow. This one. Ooh. Poisoned, silenced, petrified. Okay, one of these would probably be pretty good. Jo 
Just give the word. Win with the cleric in battle, perform an perform an action to exercise an undead enemy, obtain a buff card. So, undead, I see. Alright, let's go check. Check it out. Uh, rather than swiftness, we will use exorcisms. Seems pretty decent. Solution. Someone has a thing that is designed against undead. Ah, oh, it's him, right? Yeah, sanctuary. Up to an elevation difference of four. That's interesting, but I don't know that that matters. Can you do both at the same time? That'd be interesting. class that the class that I'm thinking of Born specific. God damn it. Thank you, game. Basically, I'm looking for the one that has in the increased AoE.
Why is there not just a fucking wiki that has this? Ugh. Tactics Ogre Reborn Classes. Okay, Necromancer is what I'm looking for, actually. That's that's what I'm looking for. Right? Engulf, yeah. Necromancer has Engulf 1 and Engulf 2. Which increases the range of things, which I believe is AoE. It's not it's not range, it's how many spaces does it fucking hit? I think? Am I thinking... Am I misremembering? Oh, fucking... Warlock has that too, actually. Hmm. Okay, hold up. Warlock, Warlock might be worth it then. Maybe. Warlocks have spell books. Spell books are good. Oh, Wizard also gets in gold. Gets it at 20, I think, at the same locations. I don't know when. Spell book is probably a big deal. I don't know. I wish this game, again, like, this This is my big complaint over Tactics Ogre versus uh, something like Final Fantasy Tactics is... This game just doesn't tell you anything about the classes. You you have no way of knowing what you're working towards with the classes. Like, I have no idea what else I could get without looking up a guy. It's it's annoying. You know, it's just, just meh. Should be fine, though. Exceeds the nat- What? We have to bring in less. Oh, goodness. Well, full court and aerosol, I think, are the back seats here. against Frigantis, Denim of Goliath. I do it. I don't know why we have fewer units in this fucking fight. There's nothing fun about having fewer units. Denim, you say? Then we are betrayed. Cursed sister. Hey, it's Cressida! Or Cressida. I don't know. Nothing I can't handle, Cressida. Go now. Inform Master Nyveth of our visitor. The second. What? And leave you here alone, Mother? 
You must permit me to stay, I beg you. Do not worry yourself, Romain. Master Nybeth's artifact will serve you, should it come to that. Now get you gone. Have care, mother. Mama, Mama's gonna die. Sorry, Cressida. Denizens of the Abyss, from the ink of blackest night, I summon you. Darkness to me! Damn it, Nybeth. Utterly terrifying. Wait, that's just a lizard man. What? Okay, that's a ghost. That's a skeleton. The blood of my dearest daughter, Moldova, stains your hands. Blood calls for blood. Or y'all could not fight me. What's y'all's choice? Get rid of that shit! We're not about that. We are not about that life, Otis Bobotis. Boydis Boboidis boy. I'm so handsome. What's wrong? Bodus to Bodus? The mama again? Oh no. Even what? We getting sick. We getting sick. Yeah. There's a green card.
What is it? Vitality? Well, go in there and die for it. just picking on him at this point they're just picking on Jay at this point That's gonna be chunky. As chunky as I would want. Resurrect him. Yeah. Exercise him. Yeah. Can I heal him. Yes. Come on in. Oh, he's got what you call it up. Come on and slam. And welcome to the jam. important to heal than to get rid of oh, huh?
actually going to go ahead and just... Well, no. I don't want I don't want that guy to just turn around and do the exact same thing again. Uh close. No, oh, it will hit him. Will hit her. Poor choice. Fucking skeleton with a bow. This is bullshit. Perhaps they have cause to name you hero after all. You fit the part. But Master Nybet has taught me much of the necromantic arts. Will you endure them so well? You use souls and corpses for sport. Do you never regret the path you've chosen? Simple child. Life and death are but two parts of a whole. Faced with death, a man will do anything to escape it. A soldier is no exception. That's not... That's, that has nothing to do with what I just said, lady. This is what battle is. The earnest avoidance of our doom. I wonder if you Yeah, for sport question all. mark? I don't I don't whispers of the dead. Their cries. How they yearn to go on fighting. The flames of their vengeance burn bright. <laughs> what a boy. Oh shit! <laughs> you just straight up summoning more fucking people. That's fucked up. to use the laments of the dead against them. Why keep them from rest? How little you understand. The dead are much like the living, you see. Some there are with pure hearts, gentle and kind. Would they be the same ones that had gentle and pure hearts while they were alive? But there are also ones who hunger to take up the sword once more and ravage the living. Yeah, but they can only do that if you magic them to do so. So you're still at fault Your here. Your war has filled the charnel houses to overflowing. There are legions of dead only too glad to strike at you. Yeah, again, they can only do that if you... If I must sever fucker. their bond with this life a second time, so be it. Put this lady down. Her arguments make no sense. Ooh. Oh, this is gonna be good. I'm gonna. Whoosha. Whoosha. Fucking knew it. I faced in the right direction too. No. 
I don't like that. What's up, Cassandra? Thanks for nullifying yourself. Holy shit! Oh my goodness, that's that's sketchy. I don't like that. I don't like that at all. Oh well, she did. Forgive Bye, Cassandra. Cressida. I go to walk with Moldova once more. You attacked me. You did not have to attack me. There's literally traveling to Brigantis, and you were just like, yo, let's fight. <laughs> you trying to sleep for? Huh? Huh? Sleepy boy. Ooh, tornado time, tornado two. Spell charge. Hold up. Oh, we're still at level cap? Oh, that's rough. I thought I thought we had level capped or leveled up since. But we did not. Uh what was I wanting I wanted to check here? Here? We have not obtained Acid Rain 2. Bad luck. Dazam. Dazap. There's no mixing and matching of skills or anything like that either, which is sad. Warren report. The Reason Way. The Ryzen Way? While pursuing Galgasani remnants, Denim battles a mage wielding necromantic magic. Cressida. Hello, Cressida. A Galgastani who once served her clan in battle, she is the daughter of the necromancer Nybeth. Together with mother Cassandra and sister Moldova, she practices necromancy under her father, believing that reviving the flesh of the dead by calling their souls back to the transient world deserves to dispel their feelings of regret. A Galgastani who once fought for the armies of Galgastan. She is the wife to the necromancer Nybeth. Cassandra also practiced the dark art of necromancy, and together they instructed their daughters Moldova and Cressida in its ways. 
They believed that necromancy allowed those who died before their time a chance to fulfill their ambitions. Cassandra battled Denim to avenge her daughter Moldova's killing, but was slain. Tisk tisk. All right. Uh, double check. Possible stuff. Me. Apparently my nose be dripping, yo. Um, okay. Let us scout it out. So in a moment, I'm going to check this real quick. Okay. Uh, ooh, this is going to be a big fight. I got to pee. I'll be right back. Let us begin! What do we got going on? Snow? Ugh, snow is not going to be great. We got, oh, Griffon. Ooh, Dracons. Cross Dracons. Oh. <laughs> oh, no. This isn't going to be fun. This isn't going to be fun at all. This is going to be rather unfun. In point of fact. Hiya. The air is chill. It is. This would make a foul place for battle. Let's on to Brigantis. That you stand before me can only mean my mother and I are forever parted. Well, you know. Not my fault. It is she who profaned the dead. I'll not mourn her passing. Yield now, or rejoin her in the Everworld. Hector, what are you doing here? I've come on word of Master Nybeth. He foresaw these attacks on you and your mother. He is a necromancer, with power beyond our understanding. He sees much that escapes the ken of lesser men. But Sir Zabos would never consent to divide his forces, few as they are. The High Commander turned a blind eye when I made from the castle. You are the sister of my betrothed. May she rest in peace. I could not sit idle knowing the danger you faced. 
Aww. Such a good guy. Caring about the necromancers. Thank you, Hector. There is no fiercer guardian of this place than your mother. Her absence is a warning. This was there. Then, Cressida, oh, you should hurry to Brigantis. Let me deal with these dogs. Was slightly depressing the button. Rubbish. We fight them together. They've claimed my sister's life and now my mother's. I owe them dear. Please, Cressida. Master Nybeth ordered me to see you return safe to the castle. Go. For me, if not for him. After all we've lost, to lose you is more than I could bear. I'll not go. Not for you, or my father, or anyone. We are beaten. The High Commander would never say as much, but the people of Galgistan are no longer with us. Master Nybeth is not one to deny hard truths. He sees reality. And so he fears for your safety. I am a knight. I swore an oath to Galgistan. And your sister. I vowed to stand by them in life. And in death. That's stupid. I beg you, save yourself. You must understand. Without you, who would there be to remember Moldova and me as we were? You, by laying down your arms. My sister chose her husband well. And moving on with your life. No, she did not. <laughs> I get it. D different, different time, different, uh, different, you know, priorities. But my now God. My love turns to vengeance. Denim of Goliath. She came at me. She came at me. Did not have to be that way. She came at me. We're actually gonna let if the if the Griffin's gonna charge us, we're gonna let the Griffin charge us. It'll take everyone else another turn or two to catch up. So burn the Griffin down in that time. Otis is disturbed. I am Hector de Daro, son of Briam, knight of Galgastan. I thank the father for bringing you before me this day, Denim of Goliath. Hector does look pretty cool. Like, he'd be a cool character. We could pick him up. Of my destiny, wife and her mother. I swear you will not live to see another dawn. I'm gonna have to make you break that promise.
because that's going to give the left side more time to converge. I don't want that. Up, I suppose. Looking like we're not going to get the griffin before the next wave. That's okay. Do what we can. Oh no, not the empower dragon. See resonance. Ooh, I want that crit. I want that crit bad. Oh, ho -ho! and that's why I wanted that crit. Oh, yeah. Charge is cool. I mean, I would prefer... Dragon. 
You bitch. Reducing that action economy. What if I... If I went right next to her? Uh, nope. Actually worse. But... It's not worth it if we're not going to Nova one of them. Uh, I would rather just attack. And maybe pick up a good defensive position or an item. One, two, three, four. One, two. So let's just take a good defensive item or position. Item. That guy is a little tough. Heal too. Heal two. Potentially dropping him could be good. Stopped! Man, Rending Gale is so fucking good, honestly. Brain Heart. Oh. Okay, okay, okay. He ain't playing. our situation here. Okay. Can I Dark Blade kill this guy? I can't. Perfect. We'll pull back slightly. Uh, 
guy is going to come in, so he's going to be a problem. The shot. Oh, that's going to hurt somebody. Somebody. Ow! Not bad. Try to haste in him to get him out of there. We want to pull back slightly. Move in here and major heal. Carry these healers. Kind of like keep them in check a little bit. You are a ferocious warrior, Denim. Though you be my foe, I will not deny you that. The blood of innocence stained your name. Your kinsmen hunt you, and still your blade does not waver. My father, Briam, had the right of it when he said you would not meet your end here. I want no praise from a creature of Balbatos. Fair enough. See, this is where Denim actually kind of like shows that he's young and he's wrong. He's incorrect. He should absolutely accept praise from Hector. Hector is not an evil man. He, to my understanding, right? Like he is just, he's just misguided, right? Like he, his loyalties are, are to the wrong people and he is bound by honor to, to, you know, Protect, serve, um, uphold their memory, etc., etc. I think not that all of Gargastan's knights gloried in doing as we were bid. Duty, honor, loyalty. A knight is nothing without these. I could not break the oath I swore to Gargastan. Then cast down your sword and surrender. It's Zabos we're after. No matter how futile my struggle, I'll never surrender. I will not break the vows I swore to my kingdom and to my beloved. <laughs> uh, I'm getting Fate snap on. To do less than fight to the end is to dishonor those who've fallen. See, Hector's not a he's not a just horrendously bad guy. He's just very misguided. Uh, yeah, that might cause death if we don't do something. Um, so, heal. Might be death regardless. And we're gonna move here, actually. You're as stubborn as you are loyal. Are you so eager to join Moldova and Cassandra in death? There is a future for Valeria, for Galgastan. If only you had eyes to see it. Yep. I do as my liege lord bids. Such is the warrior's lot. Then this frozen plain will be your grave. Yep. And that's the right of it. this guy before he can be healed. Okay. Gonna go face off against this guy.
Damn. That was the that was the thing I was hoping to achieve. Fuck. Well. That was enough. Okay. I don't really have a reason to to be killing all of these people, so I guess I'm just gonna kill um, Hector at this point. Because we are level capped right now. He didn't breach. He breached with the other thing. Right. And the Aeris cell's not gonna do shit. Again, we're just using him to block the dragons so that they can't get past him and into our back line. In hopes that she won't heal him. Basically. It's blocked and parried. Shit. Good stuff to me. Let's just kill her instead. Actually, doing really good on this fight. Truth be told. Way better than I thought we were going to. Get up, Paul Kurt. Here he is. He is really, really obsessed with the idea of killing, uh, uh, fucking Ayan, or whatever the fuck his name.
Oh, I, thought I was not paying attention. I thought that was going to hit. Feels weird why when certain weapons just don't do any damage to certain people. Like that did not really feel proper. Doofa. Fan gonna get revenge. Revenge. Nice. You are a worthy foe, Denim of Goliath. Zabos may have met his match. Yeah, he already lost to me once. I beg one. Kindness only. Cressida, my beloved sister. Take pity on her. I would have taken pity on you. I'd take pity on literally anyone that would let me take pity on them. But none of you fuckers let me take pity on you. All of you are like, we will fight to the death. Uh, Moldova. I re return to your side. Sure. Cool guy. Stupid. But cool. Dragon steak. Mmm. That actually it matters. We actually have a bunch of items that we haven't taken a look at in a while. A cutlass. Could be good. Aren't we capped? Yeah, we're fucking capped. We've been capped for two fucking fights. So here's the thing. I actually don't have a problem with the level cap. It's just annoying to me that it doesn't raise in the pacing that I think it should raise. You know? Like, I feel like it should just bump every map. Like, once... Go up one every map, or whatever. But it's like, every couple maps, it's like, here, we're gonna raise three. And I'm like, okay. This defies all reason. Branton Morn. There's no mistake, Lord Regent. The host of Almorica took no part in the siege of Critinai. Then Ronway will have no choice but to dispatch his own men to assault the castle. He'll send Sir Leonar. None other can take the field against the hero of Goliath. A keen insight, my lord. Hmm. Very well. Assemble a force 5,000 strong from our armies here at Heim. At once, my lord. I beg you reconsider, Lord Regent. Dark Knight Fullock. Hmm? I trust you've not forgotten your arrangement with the High Champion. Huh. <laughs> An arrangement with certain obligations. I must ask that you refrain from making any rash moves. Obligations, you say? As I recall, you are obliged to grant me whatever aid I require to wrest control of these isles. Yet here I sit, waiting, while you lecture me about my obligations. Stay your anger, Lord Regent. 
I meant only to suggest that provoking Amorica might not be the wisest course. Have patience. You'll see. To hell with your patience and your counsel. You there, go. See that my orders are carried out. Yes, my lord. Your eminence would make enemies of us. Begging your pardon, eminence, but we've just received a man claiming to be a messenger from Almorica. Ah, uh, I wonder who it's going to be. Here. Oh, joy. And a long ride it was. Are you the regent? Why do you hesitate? Swords! Easy, lads. You wouldn't kill the messenger before you heard the message, would you? <laughs> Bold for one so young. Very well, let's have it. I knew you'd listen to reason. Besides, <laughs> I think you're going to like what you hear. You're from Almorica. Who are you? An upstanding member of the Resistance, naturally. I don't suppose you'd send away the old man, would you? Delicate business, this. <laughs> Boldness bordering on insolence. A rare breed. Go on. Leave us, Volak. This is not for Ladician ears. You may speak. Right then. We don't get to hear it? Rude. Fucking rude. Shops have new stock. Shops have new stock, they say. That interests me greatly. But we will have to check that out on the next video. That's going to be it for this one. Thanks for watching. We'll see you next time. Bye bye everybody. Hey, everybody. Thanks for watching. If you enjoyed the video, consider leaving a like, commenting, or subscribing. It really helps me out. If you'd like to see me live, head over to my Twitch at twitch.tv forward slash the distant horizon.